Hey, hey, welcome back to the Twilight Forest, and I don't know if you guys watched the last episode, but this was our containment chamber, and we had a pretty big node that we had built up, and I logged out, and when I came back, it was gone, so um, apparently there's a glitch or something like that where nodes that are created are not saved or not being saved properly or something like that so um, I don't really understand it but <clears throat> um, it seems like the existing nodes are still um, like if it's an original node and then you uh, build it up that seems to be working so I took the node that was down below here it was I don't know if you guys remember but it was right about here I think originally and I've been working on moving it slowly but surely. I've been planting a bunch of silverwood trees and just moving it slowly, slowly, slowly. And you can see, I think it was originally 186 total, and now it's 499, and it's overpowered because of the uh, crystals here. But I just got some dirt around it right now, so it won't spawn any um, wisps and stuff because... Uh, I'm going to take a break from that for a while because I spent a lot of time on the first one and then I spent a lot of time on just getting that one up here. Um, I do have some silverwood saplings which I had to go farm those and I got another one up there. Um, hopefully it'll just grow on its own at some point. I made a couple hoes of growth but <clears throat> um, I don't have any repair um, <clears throat> enchantment books so I've gone through a couple of those, but let me show you what else I did. Over here, I went and pretty much tore down our uh, original the Barrow Hill farm. I had the, the uh, zombie and skelly um, farm in it, the uh, spawners, and what I did is I actually moved the dark node up a little bit, and then I just kind of surrounded it with a uh, some glass and kind of a containment area here so we can go in there and kill the wisps when we want to and I'm hoping eventually maybe it'll spawn a giant zombie or something like that I don't know they're supposed to, the, uh, supposed to be able to spawn them I remember when I had the spawner going I used to get some witches too so I don't know if it'll spawn one of those just randomly or not so I'm hoping but uh, I think we're going to go and do something completely different now. I'm tired of working on Thomcraft, so I figured we could try and uh, do something cool and something completely new for me. So um, let me put away these silver wood saplings and I'll show you what I've been doing. Get set up here. Um, let's go ahead and toss these in the centrifuge and I have been making over here in our industrial blast furnace steel ingots and it is like really slow so um, but let's see we got 28 so that's a start at least I guess and let's come over here and I have some obsidian dust that I just crushed in the macerator. And we're going to go ahead and put this in our rolling machine, get these out of here. A bunch of metal posts, though. And I believe this is the proper. I think we're going to go reinforced rail. Which, to be honest, I'm not sure what the difference is, but it just sounds like it's probably a better thing to make. <laughs> Hopefully it won't blow up. Or Alright, so that'll get us started. I'm probably not anywhere near what we're going to need. But uh, let's go ahead and make those. Yeah, we're going to need a lot of steel for this. But let's see, what else do we need? Can't 
can't spell today. Reinforced rails. Reinforced track. So we're going to need some of these stone ties. So sticks and stone slabs. Let's grab those. And some sticks. Which we already had up here anyway, so that's okay. I'm sure we'll need a bunch. Is those stone slabs? Those are stone slabs. How about that? And all this stuff up here, it looks like. Did I not make that right? Let's take a look. Stone slab. Oh, rebar. Oof. Okay, how do you make rebar? I thought that was a stick. Um, let's take a look. Rebar. Okay, pretty basic. Uh, we do have some iron here, so let's do that. Uh, and I'm guessing that you can't make it in there. It's probably going to be in the rolling machine, of course. So let's go ahead and get that going. Just make a bunch of these. Because we are going to basically have a train and the idea is to have it go around the entire uh, base here our entire area so um, which this is a pretty big project I think let's go ahead and get these started though Let's see what this actually looks like. There you go. Wow. Not anywhere near enough. Okay, so then we do this, I believe. I get our stone rail beds, which is only seven. <laughs> and now we can make our reinforced rail, looks like. I think it's just that. Although it does give us 32, so that's pretty good. That's not bad. Okay, that's a start at least. And why don't we go ahead and make a train right now, since, um, let's see, we'll need some more iron. We'll just make all the basic stuff initially, and then I think we need two rail carts. And then, let's see, locomotive is actually what we're making. Let's look at the Okay, let's let's go over here. Okay, we got one of those already. And we need these. And then what else do we need? High pressure boilers. Luckily that's just uh I think I have some of these somewhere. Oh, just two. Hmm. Okay. So we might need to make some of those also. I got too much stuff. Alright, well, we need definitely more. How many do we need of those? Four. Alright, so let's make... Um, I don't even remember how to make those. Take a look here. Steel plate. Rolling machine. Steel. Oh, so we need more steel. <laughs> Alright. 
got our rebar. So let's do this. And I think that's going to get us. Uh, maybe not. We're going to need one more. So let's go grab some more steel. Hopefully we should have a few more. Oh yeah, let's go in now. We should go ahead and throw some more stuff in there actually. Let's grab some more. Uh, okay. What is this? This is the refined iron that we have to use. So I'm going to throw that in there. And that like that. Grab dark ashes out. And let's go ahead and make another. Another set of these. Okay. Is four of those, all right. And then what do we need? High solid brick firebox. So we need some brick fire charges. What are those? Gunpowder, coal, and blaze powder. Okay, we can do that. We need to. Okay, which I bet you I have in. Might have ah, got some already. Cool. So we don't need to worry about making those. Uh, what else did we need? Was it furnace? Let's take a look again. Just regular furnace and bricks. So that's not too bad. We should have some bricks here, I believe. Yep. Excellent. And actually, I might have some furnaces too. Let's take a look. Yes. Okay. So let's make these. We only need two of them, which works out because we only have two furnaces. Not like they're not hard to make. Okay. So let's make our locomotive. Awesome. All right. So we got our locomotive. Got some rails. Um, now question is let's grab I want to grab a couple different types of materials here so let's grab some marble some cobble let's grab some salt uh, I want to grab some gravel and let's do some basalt bricks regular bricks and marble bricks. Yeah, let's grab some basalt pavers too. Alright, so let's go ahead and let's go over here. And I think I think we'll have it run just one right off of the uh, uh, I knew that was going to happen. Question is, I'm thinking maybe gravel might be the way to go, but I'm not sure. Let's just toss all this stuff out of here. And we'll pick it up on the other side of my my bag of holding there. So let's do this, 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 and this. Oh, you know what else I need? I need to make a uh, crowbar probably. So, like if you look, and like if you go to like a regular railroad, usually a lot of times they'll have, you know, stone and gravel underneath the uh, the rails. So that's just why I was thinking of that. Let's see what that looks like. Oops. I 
definitely don't want it right on the grass. I just don't. Then I think it's like if it was the basalt bricks, you might get some contrast. So let's take a look at that. I don't know. What do you guys think? Uh, let's try. We'll make a couple of these just so we can compare. This episode is more just kind of seeing how we wanna how we wanna make it. Can't even tell the bricks. The white, I kind of like the contrast with the white. The black, the black bricks isn't bad either. Um, let's do one more. We can find some room to do it. Because maybe just the regular basalt uh, cobblestone stuff. Sure. I kind of like the black, uh, the uh, basalt bricks, to be honest. Uh, the only thing I haven't done yet is the pavers. Let's do the pavers. Um, let's do the pavers right here. Actually, so up above, I kind of like the way the cobblestone looks right off the bat, or the gravel. I don't really like the, uh, definitely not the stone bricks. I also kind of like the, uh, kind of like the marble bricks too, so I'm not sure. want to go with the cobblestone or the gravel just because I have a lot <laughs> one of the reasons because I have a lot of it and it's easy to uh, get more because I know I'm going to need a lot of it because 
we're going to follow the entire base around and we're probably going to go in through the mountain there and then across oh our tree grew hot dog or silverwood tree so that's good um, so I'm going to actually think about that for a sec I'm going to go here over here and check out the uh, silverwood tree and see if did our notes combine they did not how can they not combine it? It should have been far enough up here. Hmm. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and uh, work on this node here. And I'm going to think about what I want to do with those rails. And I'll be right back. All right. Well, it's been raining, so I've been kind of just sitting here waiting for leaves to decay. Um, as you can see, I did get the uh, node to combine again. So we're up to 533. <laughs> And I think I'll put this one here. Still needs to come up some more, so even though it's above where it needs to be in here, this actually needs to come up another probably block or two. So hopefully that will combine once that grows. And I have made a decision over here. I think I'm going to go with the cobblestone. So uh, let's go ahead and start digging. Um, and then once we come out. to be I think how that's going to look yeah it should be good easier way to put down track. <laughs> okay, let's see. Where's my train? Let's see if I can get the, put get this put down right. And of course I put them down the wrong way. So let me go grab I don't even know if I don't even think I have a crowbar. So we're gonna have to make one probably. If it was if there was one it'd be in here and I don't see it so Let's look and see how to make a crowbar real quick. I'm pretty sure it's steel and I think some dyes, I believe. Actually, it's just iron and dye, so. Um, so, what was it again? Okay, yeah, three across. So, we'll just do that. That. And I think we have some. I don't know if we have any, no, but we do have some roses over here, so, uh, let's see, what's the best way to get dye out of this extractor, probably? Although we only need four, so let's just do it like that, there we go. And where did we put that? Okay, here, here, and here. Crowbar, excellent. And let's grab, what are we gonna need? We're also gonna need some water. And let's grab some charcoal. Turn around, Buster, and we'll put the charcoal in there, and we need to get some water somewhere. I think there's 
A little pond right here. Oh, cool, you don't even have to, uh... He'll go when he's ready to go, I guess. Let's go ahead and put grab some more water. Oh, of course I did that. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> now I can't, uh... Uh, I'm not even gonna worry about it. I just don't like running water in my uh, little ponds. It doesn't look right. Oh, and it took off all by itself, so that didn't take very long. Let's put some more water in here. Ooh. Why did it do that? Okay. So let's turn him around again. And it looks like he's stuck. Come on. Definitely the wrong way. There he goes. Cool. I just like the fact that it whistles and stuff. <laughs> so now I'm just going to go ahead and. Uh, that's cool. Alright, so let's shut him down. But what I'm going to do is I need to go ahead and start digging out and clear out any trees that are in the way and probably do some digging and uh, I'm going to go ahead and get this first kind of section around. We're probably gonna, just going to go all the way around outside to cut all these trees down. I just want to go all the way down to this corner down here and probably this can come over. I'll probably come in between this little pond here and uh, the well here, so probably just come probably right come right down here. So, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start working on that, and I will be back uh, when I've made a little progress. Okay, I got my track laid basically from over there over to that well like I was talking about. But there's a couple, one more thing I want to make. Um, I need actually two of them, but it's this switch lever or lever. I don't know how you say it, but however you want to, I suppose. But um, I need to make it. And I think I have everything here. I hope. Um. I grabbed everything I needed. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, so we want two of those. I'll take that with me. Okay, so let's go ahead and head over here. And I just uh, the reason why I want the lever lever is I have these switching. Uh, switch tracks which uh, lets you direct which way you want the train to go so let's see if I can figure this out um, so I think what it's going to do right now if I put the train on there it's going to go straight around there and then come out and then I think it can go either way. If I go like that, let's see. It's definitely going to come out and go around, and it's just going to keep going around like that. Um, yeah, let's 
do... I think when it hits that, it's going to go straight, maybe? And then when it comes here, it should go right, or go left, I think. Let's hope so. And let's see. I'm going to grab some water real quick and if I have a bucket. Are you kidding me? Again, pet peeve. Oh, come on. <laughs> it's so annoying. Alright. Do I still have my bucket of water? I do. Okay. Alright, so we have our track going all the way down here. And again, I have a little, a little loop. And hopefully I can get my switch out here and I think that'll work I think if it comes this way it's gonna go around like that and then it should go straight out I'm hoping all right where's my train here we go put him down Oop. oh I thought he was gonna take off where's he going hey slow down there buddy okay so we want coal and we're running. Oh, I did forget one thing. Shoot. Hold on. I want to go back here real quick. And I planted another tree up there. Um, let's see. Let's do this. Hope that's all we need. We'll put it there. And then hopefully, I think all you do is you just right click and right click. Oop, come back. Oh, maybe it's shift. Okay, yeah, see, that's going straight. Okay, so we know that works. No, it's kind of slow. All right, so we go shift. There we go. Okay, now we're good. Now, let's put, eat something. I hope this works. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure about the... All right. Oh, I guess I should get in here. And let's take a look at this. Yeah, let's just... Okay. So... Let's get some steam going. This might take a second. Do, 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 do. Well, we're going to go for a ride. Check it out. But I was thinking... I don't know what you guys think, but should I go up top? And then come down. Maybe. Oh, here we go. What do you guys think? Faster? Let's go faster. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. I like it. Going on a little train ride. We go down. Then back up, and then back down. Hey, hey, what's up? Must be one of Tusky's relatives. I haven't seen Tusky lately. I wonder where he ended up. Okay, going back up. Oh, okay, right turn. And let's see if this thing works. Oh, we took a right there. Is that right? Let's see if it straightens back out on the way back. Oh yeah, yeah, that worked. Okay. Well, now should we go faster? I don't want to go 
fast around that short corner that short corner uh because i know these things do blow up i think if they hit each other which i think if it hits a cart it might even blow up all right so let's slow this boy down and i think uh i think that's pretty good for today let's go ahead and call that episode and let's see here we go call this an episode and uh as always guys make sure you click like show me some love and make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i will catch you guys next time see you later taking the train woo, -woo.